the huge value structure behind that. Like you didn't go into the lab and shoot it up, you know? Or you didn't bring a hand grenade, right? And you didn't sexually assault the experimenter. There's lots of things you could have done in there. And you didn't do those things. You just sat there and counted the balls and missed the gorilla. Okay, so, and there's complicated reasons for that. There are deep reasons for that. And so there are deep reasons for how you perceive things and why. And so that's what we're going to go into. So, the first thing we're going to do is talk about the basics of perception. And perception is very, very tightly related to action, to movement forward, and to emotion. And those things are very important to know. They're very, they're very tightly associated. So, for example, you live in a, in a map, let's say, or a story, and the story is, um, wherever I am isn't as good as it could be, and so I'm going to go somewhere that's somewhat better. 